Hi, I'm Joseph Huddle with Huddle Landscape Architecture for landscapingnetwork.com. So on this project we decided to do a patio cover out of a combination of steel and redwood. And the, uh, the steel has many advantages over wood, one of them being the lifespan of the steel and the fact that you can achieve a structural rigidity without uh, using angled connections or overly heavy connections. You get a much lighter, airier feel with the steel. The wood, in this particular instance, provides a certain warmth that you would not get with a pure steel structure. This particular um, sunshade patio cover was sized to provide a nice outdoor dining environment for the main patio. And the post placement was dictated by the placement of the water feature and other elements. So to make up for that, we were able to uh, achieve a cantilever to shade more of the patio without having the posts right in the middle of the water feature. The steel was uh, sized appropriately to uh, allow for the spans we needed, and it was manufactured off-site with the steel fabricator, and all the welding was done off-site, and they provided us bolts and connections that we could then put it together on-site with our own landscape crew, saving on-site project costs. The uh, redwood was cut to fit within angle iron pieces that were already welded onto the steel plating. And the, uh, the paint was a custom mixed paint that we did from the hardware store using a combination of black, gray, and hunter green until we could get a nice warm, nearly black color for the steel. I'm Joseph Huddle for landscapingnetwork.com. Thanks for watching.